welcome back everyone to the pop cult layer today i am proudly reviewing superman of earth 23 so let's take a look at this awesome figure now, i've been waiting for a while since i saw him online um read him in the comics and i just i was just surprised that they finally or they took so long to make him so it's exciting to see him actually out and about and on stores and anybody can pick him up now so yeah this is so cool such a neat figure i was really waiting uh to get my hands on him and from a help from my friend at unparalleled universe for picking him up thank you so much he was hard to find um and he is in stores now all right so let's take a look at this awesome figure he is a little over six inches about six and a half so that's pretty cool um he is very articulated so his arms go out shoulder movements biceps crunch ab crunch doesn't go too far um see his knees bend ankles move knees bend waist movement cape is nice and soft really cool cape weird but I, I dig the style so you can get him in to a lot of cool poses his head moves pretty good you can have him in, a, in an awesome flying pose. So this Superman comes from Earth 23 created by Grant Morrison. And uh, I first read him in Action Comics number 9 of the New 52. Right here. And his name is Calvin Alice. He is the Earth 23 Superman. So he's uh, based off of President Obama, Barack Obama, which is pretty cool. And the I think the reference of the 23 is from Michael Jordan's number while he played uh, for Chicago Bulls and other teams. So that's kind of a cool thing because President Barack Obama he really loves basketball so I think that's another cool little nod to um, history and yeah this this character is so unique he's also appeared in the multiverse storyline also by Grant Morrison which is another cool um, storyline really entertaining and I like the fact that um, he was one of the main characters brought in to the team um, he's transported from different from his planet uh, his universe and uh, kind of uh, in a ragtag team of uh, paralleled universes heroes uh, they all come together to try to stop um, you know the this uh, evil from uh, killing off all the universes and parallel universes and stuff like that so really confusing but really entertaining uh, love his writing love Grant Morrison's writing uh, I love to to get confused and look up stuff and his stuff is really in interconnected so I like that All right, let's take a look at the design of his costume. I love the S logo on this, very simple, very bold. And I dig the bumblebee kind of yellow and black stripes going along his buckles and his boots and also his uh, belt. You know, classic Superman colors, um, different type of cape going on, no S logo on the back. Overall, a unique design. Simple, 
but very distinctive of Earth-23 Superman. So my pros and cons. Um, pros love the versatility and how much posability you can pose him in. So that's a, that's a pro. His face sculpt is one of the best face sculpts I've ever seen on a Mattel toy action figure here. So that's another pro. Um, first ever Earth-23 Superman toy made. So that is freaking awesome. Glad that they, Mattel jumped on that. Um, I wish he came with accessories. That's a that's a little something I wish Mattel would jump on, but it's okay. Um, I would love to see other characters from Earth Twenty Three pop up, and also let's get let's get an ongoing series of Earth Twenty Three. I'm so interested. Anytime they touch upon that in the comics, um. I love that, like Elseworld stories, they can they can adapt that, so that's cool. Um, so this is kind of a cool little promise, promising action figure to get. Hopefully we'll get um, Earth 2 Superman from the, uh, the New 52 or the new Lex Luthor in the Superman battle suit and even the new Superman of China that's coming out that we heard about so yeah this is a definitely a 9 out of 10 for me action figure minus uh, accessories which is one of the big problems I have but other than that really cool action figure thank you for watching and stay tuned for more toy reviews